list of three must-have items for college. My mom like loaded the car up. I, I looked like the Beverly Hillbillies coming to college. Make sure you have some sort of uh, Penn State clothing because everyone here wears Penn State clothing all the time. A memory foam mattress pad <laughs> because when you come back at the end of the day and your bed is super comfortable, it's probably the best thing in the world. Room decorations, Christmas lights are the way to go. It'll draw everybody to your room. And also a great big comfy chair to sit in, to study in, to sleep in, to read a great book, to end the long day of studying. I'd say a musical instrument. If you play one and if you don't play one, start playing one because it's a, it's a great way to bond with uh, other students. Flip-flops, essential. Uh, a whiteboard, always fun to put on your door. And lastly, a first aid kit. That could be invaluable and it probably will be. Buy rain boots. It rains all the time here. Uh, number two, Ethernet cord <laughs> so that you can get internet in your room. Uh, number three, mm, scarves because they're awesome. Bed risers, an entire convenience store worth of snacks, and uh, extra pencils because I lose them all the time. Bring like a space or like a scrapbook to put up pictures because you're gonna have tons of pictures, tons of memories, especially from your freshman year that you're never gonna want to forget. So find some way to save that. College was a big time for costume parties for me. So you know, if you have that cowboy hat, you know, bring it. You might, you never know. Or you know that those '80s leggings, you know, bring that. There will be, they will, there will be in any '80s party. There will be. To be cheesy, a really good attitude. Everyone's so happy here, and if you don't bring a good attitude, well, first you're gonna get one, because it's infectious, and second, you know, just, Penn State's just a great place, and just come here with an open mind and a good attitude, and you're gonna do really well.